Yo, what's up, everybody? So, I don't know what just happened, but we started Chapter 3, and we were about 15 minutes in, and OBS just crashed or stopped the recording for whatever reason. So, just to kind of fill in everybody, basically everything that's happened is Abby, the girl that liked the other dude who kissed uh, Emma... She ran off, and then the Nick guy got killed by a monster, and that's all gone. That's all that footage is gone. I can't go back. So there was there are monsters on the island, and then Jacob and the Emma, the hot chick, they went skinny dipping, and uh, they found dead bodies underneath the water, but Emma didn't see one. Only Jacob did, and now we're back at the party. Hopefully some monsters are coming in soon. I just I, I don't understand why I wasn't recording. I just looked over, and OBS wasn't recording at all. I have like the intro. Ah, fucking bullshit. So, anyway, shit's going down. So, any second, we should be seeing fine stuff. Social disruption there, Kaylin, I have to say. Ah, or was it just the nudge that Abby needed? You're an evil genius. Who do you think is going to make the first move? Nick or Abby? Oh, good cue. My bet's on either. I don't know. Nick's got the beast in him. Uh, if by beast you mean some sort of mild-mannered baby deer. Hey, don't let that cute, preppy aesthetic fool you. It's like a steel barbecue grill under that shirt. <laughs> so, you noticed that too, huh? So, what do you guys want to do now? We can keep playing. Yeah? Just the three of us? All right, Dylan. Truth or... All right, here we go. So Abby's screaming. Oh my gosh. This is when she was getting attacked by a monster simultaneous. Wait, where did it come from? This way. Come on. Abby! Help! Please! Nick! Help him! Hey! What happened? Abby, what happened? Brian! We gotta know what... Well, she needs help. Give her a second. Go after Nick. Go! Okay. Let's do it. Got this. That shotgun's got a hell of a spread. Be careful. All right, finally, some shit's going down. That's how I run. What is, what is what am I a fucking track star? Fuck. I thought it was gonna be up. It's always up. We're taking shortcuts, bro. God, this up and left is... Thought they were gonna have me go right. I was wrong. I was wrong. <laughs> Take the stairs. Holy quick time event, bro. Oh shit. Hey! Get the fuck off of him. 
Stop! Stop! I'll shoot! God damn! Holy shit, dude! Oh, not, not, not. Hey, hey, can you walk? Jack, gotta go. Come on, come on, come on. Get back to the fire. Oh. Dude, the thing's got to be in the trees or something. Where is the enemy? Free back there, Jacob. What are you doing? Okay. Yeah, what are you doing? Okay. Oh, great, dude. <laughs> and you're freaking naked, bro. It's, a, it's either the damn pig or it's actually a real monster. Hello? Oh, shit. God damn, this looks so real. Is this? Oh, come on. Who the fuck are you? Fuck you, you fucking asshole. Who is this? Oh, Jesus Christ, what the fuck are you doing? Dude, I think this is, uh... That dude from Boy Meets World back in the day, the big fat guy. I forget his name. Son of a bitch. Oh, what are you doing? It is. Helps if you close your eyes. Doing? Ethan Supply. Oh. Tastes bad, don't it? Yeah, it's definitely him, dude. This guy's awesome. Where are you off to now, girly? Holy shit! I love that actor. He's awesome. What the fuck? What the fuck? Huh? Damn, they got the boar too. Okay. Still, nothing's really happening. I'm not, haven't really been scared yet. Seems like just a blink and you're back to see me again. Yeah, except for OBS didn't record and I fucked up. Then, what have we got? It's the star. 
Stars, stars in the night, sky, beacons of light, dreams of hope, purpose, or a reminder of our insignificance, fear of despair, trust in the light of the star, with it comes clarity, and sometimes truth. Remember, there's always more. This honestly has like a out. Resident Evil. Would you like me to show you? Style to it. Not the gameplay or anything like that, but. I don't even know what I just saw. Back to it then. Back to Hackett's Quarry. Back to Hackett's Quarry you go. Oh, the fun you'll have. This is a weird game. That was horrible. It was, it, it was, I, I, I don't even know what it was. It was so fast and, and there was a, uh, there was a hunter and it was just. Oh, Abby. Here. What? Oh, try drawing. Drawing what? Oh, uh, can you draw what attacked you? That's actually good writing. Not bad. She has the skill of, of drawing. God damn. Is his leg broken? Nick. Hey, buddy. Can you tell us what happened? I'm a little attacked. What is Happy? He's super out of it, man. We need to know what happened. All right. There was. There was a guy there, but there was some kind of, some kind of animal. The hell? What fucking kind of animal does this? Dude, that Dylan's the best. Or not Dylan, but the other guy. Who the hell is this? Ryan. The, I like the, I like the dude on the left. Is Abby? Yeah, hey, she, hey, she's okay, dude. She's right over there. Because... Teeth were on top of me. I think it was a bear. Full size bear would have crushed him. There's no way. I thought we don't get bears right here. Oh fuck! Look at that. Oh fuck. shit! That black stuff. That's that's infection. That's and it's it, it's spreading. This is bad. This is really bad, dude. Uh, sorry. Uh, sorry. Uh, You're okay. It's okay. Uh, fuck that. We should amputate. We should cut it off before the infection spreads. What? Why would we do that? I don't know, man. Look at that black stuff. What? What do you think it is? Do I look like a doctor? Yeah, that's pretty much what it looked like. No, we'll just wait here. We'll just wait patiently. Just sounding pretty good right about now, yeah. Put it in 
Don't shoot! Don't shoot! I'm here to save you. Holy shit. Nick. Is he okay? Nick and Abby were attacked. In the woods. Hey, does anybody have any dry clothes? I'm, I'm fucking freezing. All our bags are still in the minivan. Oh, fuck, of course they are. So wait, what happened to you? Right, right, okay, so, like I was saying, okay? I heard Abby screaming, so I came running, like as fast as I could. From the lake? Yeah, and then, and then out of nowhere, I stepped into this, like, I don't know, like a, like a booby trap? Like some sort of hunter's trap? The goddamn thing snared my leg, hoisted me halfway into the tree, just zoop! So I'm hanging there, half naked, and then this guy with like a fucking machete comes right up to me. Looks me right in the fucking eyes. But I taught that guy a lesson, booked it right the fuck out of there. We gotta get Nick and Abby back to the lodge. Like, right now. Uh, hard agree. Also, why are you covered in what I hope is strawberry jelly? Oh, yeah, no, um, I'm pretty sure it's blood. It was this guy with like, um, he had like a bottle. Thing. I don't know, dude, it's like a really long story. Ew. Yeah, no, it's super fucked up. Oh, it, Jesus Christ, I can't believe I haven't told you this yet. I, I saw a fucking body in the lake. Like, a dead one? Oh, no, 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 Um, one of the, one of the swimmers from the varsity swim team, he got lost on the way to practice and it was, yes, a dead one, dumbass. Of course you did, Jacob. No, for real, I did. I, I figured it must have been one of the counselors that didn't show up, but I couldn't tell, because it was like all, all bloaty and gross. Something's not right. Gotta go get Emma. Uh, excuse me. Hey, I need this, okay? It's not safe out there. Dude, we gotta protect Nick and Abby. Yeah, and I need to save Emma, all right? She's out there alone. You don't even know if she's in trouble. You don't even know if you're in trouble. Are you trying to piss me off? No, I'm trying to save my girlfriend's life, asshole. Yeah, I don't think she's your girlfriend, dude. What? Get... here guys you're acting like pricks both of you jacob we're keeping this nick and abby are injured we need protection there's someone around here <laughs> ryan sorry this is bullshit make sure she's safe if she's on the island she's definitely fine and what risk another uh, run-in with captain deliverance no thanks okay there's probably another boat by the zip line either way i can make it to the island from there we need to get back to the lodge. Try to get help. How? Nick can't walk properly. Yeah, I have an idea. I mean... Can we just shoot something, please? I like the shooting. It's it's hard, it's fun. She had her... They have their clothes, like, right... Okay. Here's a riddle for right you. by the fucking dock. Got two thumbs and is suddenly riding solo on a freaky island in the dark. This fool, well, one thumb, one available thumb. Okay. And it was here, on a strange, uninhabited island that this brave young soul found herself. Dude, these graphics are unreal. Okay, full disclosure, I've suddenly found myself on a a strange, tiny little island, all alone, with nothing to do but show you guys around. So, there's a treehouse over there. I'm gonna go and see if I can't dish out some of that sweet, sweet panoramic goodness. Because here's the thing. Not that I want to go back, because I don't. But even if I did, I can't. Because then I'd look like the super needy one when he was the one who, who stormed off in the first place. God, you know what? Sorry, I'm bending. Explore venting. You know what? Fuck it. Let's do it. To the treehouse, fellow explorers. Something. 
Well, I've always wanted to be a hot girl in my bra. So now here's uh, my opportunity. And this is the meeting shelter. It's a shelter where you meet at. Okay, I'm trying really hard to make this interesting, but sometimes a thing just is what it is. I think I've made my point. All right, can we continue on here? My God. So this island is like an unexcavated part of the quarry that rewilded itself after it flooded into the lake. Pretty cool, huh? You know, when I was little, I used to think that islands just kind of would float in the middle of the water, kind of like an airbed. But I'm older and wiser now and realize that not everything's always as it seems. Kind of like how you thought you were just having a hot summer fling and then it turns into babysitting a big hairy man child who's all sad because you don't want to go steady with him and write him love letters every freaking day. And while we're talking about it, you don't mind that we're talking about it, right? Why? Why is it up to me to justify my feelings when he's the one who got all blah about it, you know? <sighs> oh, look. Well, we could all answer that, it's but that's not matter. the point of the game. I mean, a fork in the road. How fitting. Here's the big question. Do I take the high road, literally, and forget about it? Or do I continue on the path I'm on and keep ranting about my stupid dumb life. Whatever gets you killed. I guess since this isn't live, the choice is up to me. I'm just waiting for someone to be in the background. But I'm going up. Okay, moving up in the world. Let's do this. Now you might notice the darling rustic vibes this walkway is radiating, and that's no accident. I don't know what y'all are doing with your walkways, but if you're not spending a full hour pulling a splinter out of a snotty kid's finger, don't you dare call it authentic. Don't worry, the kid was fine. I'm a good counselor. And what doesn't kill you will make you stronger. That's it. Okay. Little robotic with the way they walk. It's all right, I guess. Oh shit. Okay, all right. Okay. So this is where earlier Is where we're heading not too shabby well literally is too shabby but these views oh man you're gonna blow your tops there's also a zip line which eh, i guess you can watch me crap my pants on that thing what the hell i'm here aren't i i'm gonna carpe this dm so damn hard it won't know what hit it Friends, this is exactly where we saw the bad guy in the house so to talk about You know what Jacob's real problem is? He thinks he's starring in his own movie. He sees everything like it's happening to him. She says, recording her own reality show. Ugh, whatever. He wants to be with me because he thinks it'll make him happy when I don't think he's even ever thought about what I want. Okay, that's not true. Honestly, I think I'm deflecting. I know he'll meet someone at college and forget all about me. Good for him. He deserves it. Maybe I should start going all freaky clingy and stuff. Maybe that'll scare him off. Like, like show up at his house in a in a wedding dress or something like that. Loki actually considering it. But hey, here I go again, trying to turn everything I do into some sort of dramatic experiment. I like this girl. I like how introspective her character is. Reminds me of my fucking self. So far, I don't have that nice of an ass. All right. I'm fucking terrified. 
Oh, no, no. This isn't where we saw the bad guy. The bad guy wasn't in the treehouse. They were in like a watchtower or something. Oh, look. Car keys. Police car keys. Oh, I'm shit. I'm sorry, officer. I have no idea what you're talking about situations. So I'm just going to go ahead and leave those right there. Bro. And here we are, as promised, one extremely ah, okay. and even more underwhelming tree house. You've got my attention, the quarry. In another world, perhaps young Jacob and I would settle down here and play house together. Honey, I'm home. What's that now? I forgot the children's bedtime. Well, now, that's a fine how do you do. This is fucking creepy, dude. Take it all in, folks. That's the summer camp experience right there. And oh, look, it se seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. I guess one of the kids left their stuff or maybe one of the guys back there. But I don't recognize this. Did you hear that? Looks like we have a choice on our hands. Do we snoop through someone else's belongings or do we open? The spooky trap door and die a horrible, painful death. There are literally no right answers. Get the fuck out. <sighs> Goodbye, cruel world. The final curtain is calling, and there's no time for an encore. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. That was amazing. Oh, I I didn't want her to die, man. I mean, I guess as long as the main character lives, that's all that matters, but I got it. He's okay. Are you in pain? No, no, sorry. I'm just... I'm really hungry. We'll get you some food inside, okay? Yeah, okay. Come on. Come on. Oh, man. I can eat a horse. <laughs> well, I don't know if we'll be able to find you a horse, but maybe some granola? Oh, yuck, I hate granola. These cars are hard to find. I don't quite understand it. This will open the nurse's station. Should be plenty of stuff in there. Well, hopefully we can just get him cleaned up for now. I'll get you something to eat. Who started the fire? You and I are going to find a landline. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, isn't there one in Mr. H's office? Yup. We'll come meet you. Copy that. Do you think that whatever attacked them out there is... I don't know, has their scent or something? What? I don't know, like, what if it got a taste for blood and now it's gonna track them down? I... I doubt it. I just feel like if we stick with them, we're sitting ducks. I don't know. I really don't think that whatever attacked them out in the woods is gonna get into the lodge. Okay, yeah. Yeah, you're, you're probably right. <sighs> Come on. Let's go call for backup. Lock the door. Shut. It's pretty weird to see this place so dead. You never came down here at night while camp was in session? What? No. Did you? A couple times. Yeah. Damn. Where are you going? I, I, I thought I just heard my name. I didn't hear anything. Shut the door. Why didn't they shut the door? I don't think Nick's injuries are as bad as we thought. Who 
We don't know that. No, it's true. Caitlin said. So all I'm saying is that we are not professionals, okay? We don't know. We He could have rabies or something. Way to be optimistic, man. I'm just being realistic. We gotta call for help. Who should I call? Uh, Mr. H? The only number I got is to this phone. Okay, then 911. You mean 911? Who says 911? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I... Anyway, yeah, but like what? Dylan's hiding people, something, like, bro. Police, ambulance. Huh. Well, do you need to specifically ask for an ambulance or can you just say, help, help? So they'll say, 911, what's your emergency? And I'll say, Help, help, my friends may have been attacked by bears, but maybe not a bear, but definitely an animal with teeth. And then one of them was kidnapped by these hunter guys with blood on their faces, and there may have been shots fired, but not by us, but also maybe by us. And they cut my friend Jacob down from a tree. Separate incident. Long story. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's good. Okay. Okay. What's wrong? Dead. Well, that's weird. Phones go dead sometimes out here. Right when you're about to call the cops, though? It's a coincidence. Did you try the hang up thingy? What? Here. What? What are you doing? I don't know. It's what they do in movies when the phone goes dead. You tap on the little thingy. We're not in a movie. Okay. Well, you know, how do you know that? Maybe that's just what they want you to think, man. <laughs> this dude's the best. I love this game. Except for the first so three hours. Or... No one has signal. Is there anywhere else in the camp that has a landline? Well, not a... Oops. Landline. What? The radio hut has some old broadcast gear. Where, where you do your announcements? Where I curate my sweet summer jams, yeah, and where I do the PA announcements. It has some old equipment there. I think we could probably break something up and get a message out. All right, yeah. Let's, let's head over there and see if we can contact somebody. Put that back, Dylan. No! You gotta be fucking crazy if you think I'm gonna go out there without something to defend myself. It's more of a safety concern. Oh, do you think I'm gonna shoot my eye out? Or your whole head? Don't be a dick, man. I know how to use this. Yeah, fuck that, dude. What is up with them and like... Uh, it's, it's probably the weather. <laughs> what weather, Ryan? <laughs> Maybe it was the bears. Bear. And why does everyone blame everything on bears? Okay, so for the sake of argument, what if that bear that uh, cut our phone line and just cut out all the power, what if that bear is waiting for us out in the hallway? Fair point. Thank you. We should probably tell Caitlin that we're going to the radio hut. They're probably freaks. Yeah, okay, yeah, let's go. Yeah, we should probably leave that with Caitlin. Bolt, maybe we should just leave her with your gun. I'm a much better shot than you. You don't know that, okay? I might be an amazing shot. I might be. It's, it's... Just give her your gun. I'm keeping this shit. He's my favorite. Well, fuck that. I'm keeping it. Dude, if those hunter guys come back, she's basically a sitting duck in here. You're being really selfish right now. It's not a good look on you. No, I'm just being safe. I can't believe you're being such an asshole right now. Who gives a fuck? Look, you don't tell me what to do, man, okay? I'm sorry, but it's it's not going to happen. Good. What are, we even, what are we even talking about? Just give her the gun. We don't need it. We already have a gun. 
Fuck. Are you finished berating me? Well, I could go on, but please take your turn. <sighs> Look, I know that you're Mr. Large and in charge in a crisis. And that's great, but I finally feel like I have one piece of control over the situation, and you want me to give that up, and that's just brutal, dude. It's, it's not worth having this argument with you. Well, you started it, man. I don't give a shit what Ryan likes. And I interrupted something? Chin up, big guy. It, I wouldn't really know what to do with it, okay? I trust you. Oh, thank you so much, Dylan. You're so generous and handsome. Yeah, no problem. Don't mention it. I mean, I just want everyone to get killed. Oh, good to see you. Good to see you. Huh. A time again, is it? Strength. Hmm. Strength can be surprising. Knowing one's own raw power, tapping into it, tapping into a previously unknown. What is the whole point of this lady? There are forces at work within us all. And with one hand it gives, and with the other it could rip away. As always, there's more to see. And as always, the choice is yours. Would you like to see more? Who's that? Is that Eric? So it's goodbye again. I'll leave you with this. Remember who your friends are. Remember who's looking out for you. All right, I think we're at chapter four, three, five, five. Oh, shit. All right. Well, I think that's a good place to end here. We are going to continue with this series throughout the week. But thank you guys so much for watching this episode of The Quarry. We'll get this game out as quick as possible to you because I know you're itching for more. What an interesting game. I, I don't really know how I feel about it. It's kind of boring, but it's like a movie. So it's like, I don't know. It's like a Netflix series that you just kind of binge, but you get to press A in. I don't know. It's not terrible. I'm having a good time. I hope you're having a good time. And if you are, make sure you leave your uh, comments and your likes and all that bullshit. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.